Hola, my name is Erika Harsh. I'm originally from Mexico City, but I work and live in between Mexico and New York. Um, I'm an immigrant, as so many people, in a world of constant global mobility where you're looking for the space to live that would suit your needs, that would suit your better living situations. For some, safety, for some, humanitarian rights, but also uh, the possibilities to, to cross borders uh, freely, to, to live in many different places. And I lived also in Italy, in Germany, Brazil. And 16 years ago, I came to New York, the city that you see right behind. This is my neighborhood, Long Island City, Queens. And uh, I've been here 16 years, and I came pursuing the dream, just with a suitcase and my dream. And talking about dreams and desires, and this is a city of dreams and desires, as you can see, um, I realized that I was an immigrant myself. And as an immigrant, I became akin to so many immigrants like me that have to endure and go through hardship to be able to gain uh, a visa or to get a status. And since then, I've been doing projects that are related to immigration. I did a passport that unifies Mexico, Canada, and United States as a North American continent without borders. And the project that you're gonna see at B3 uh, Frankfurt Biennial is called Under the Same Sky We Dream that talks about free borders, about borders that would create a safety net for so many different people that are trying to, to cross and, and, and look for safety and humanitarian uh, rights in, because of different circumstances. So the project is actually a recreation of a detention center for undocumented unaccompanied minors at the borders of Texas and Mexico, basically on Texas, where actually immigration has been treated as a crime. Um, the project also talks about unregulated immigration and uh, legislations that have not been uh, supported and that have not been applied and living in limbo so many people and so many children like the dreamers that now it's in, in a terrible controversy because dreamers are left adrift and uh, we're hoping that this changes but the project you, that you're gonna see is a video that has more than 35,000 photographs in time-lapse from the border of Mexico, Ciudad Juarez and El Paso, Texas and the Bill of Congress that was never approved the Dream Act, sung by the Mexican singer Mago Herrera. So I hope you enjoy the piece and um, you can visit uh, the website of the Biennial or my website to get more information. And looking forward to being there and, and do more projects and get the possibility to meet you. Thank you, ciao.